people wonder like why are people so bad at this fucking shit like especially with the money that some people have gotten from sack funds and stuff or whatever the fuck they've gotten or like people have gotten in terms of investments in vcs fuck people suck at crypto bro like mm. you, it's, it, yeah if you if you really had like if you really had 20 million liquid right now right you could do so mm -hmm. much with that bro you could do so much i mean you could fuck i mean you could fuck off five million of it and still be good bro and still keep going it's so it's just I, i'm very unimpressed with what people have done you know there's a lot of money that's sacrificed in in pulse chain ecosystem projects and stuff like but that. even outside of pulse chain too like i know tons yeah, of projects outside, are getting yeah. DC money and they're not doing shit with it they're not doing sh they suck ass at it they can't even they can't even properly buy the bottoms they can't fucking do it they can't trade they can't fucking invest it correctly they're fucking scared they have it in like it's just stupid. Sh I mean, it's just basically they all suck. DCC, you you need a sacrifice phase, man. Yeah, <laughs> you need to launch, bro. launch a project, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, yeah. but I reckon people. I reckon you could you could pull some people in. A hundred percent. Oh no, I, I know. I, mean, I know. I could. I know. I could do it. And to tell you the truth, I know I could do a really great job. Yeah, I know I could do. I a think really you good. would. There's, I think no, you would. I mean, fuck. If I if I ran like there's not not to toot my own horn here, but this is the truth. I could, if I did ran a sack last cycle. I, there's no way in hell that I wouldn't be up like three times on the sack money right now. A hundred percent. There's just no way because like I would have bought Bitcoin and Ethereum lows. Yeah. I, I bought the, I bought the Bitcoin low within three hundred dollars, and I bought into the Ethereum low literally in eight hundred dollars. Amazing. Even if I missed it, and I was like I only like pussy footed twenty five percent at the bottom there, and then they went up a little bit, and then I decided to eat the rest of it in. I would have caught Solana too. I, I caught the lows on everything, everything. Yeah. Bro, yeah. could have multiplied the money and then just been sitting, dude. Oh my god, bro! Like, what was, what was your I, thesis on that? Was it just kind of like a, a time and analysis of what yeah. what things have done? Well, me, me and Charlie, me and Charlie have a, a, a me and Charlie have a very we have a calculus, a, a sort of a calculation and and sort of like a, uh, a time frame as well. Like it's it, we, there's it's much more mathematical to DCA into bottoms than it is top tops or it's wisp it's it's hope it's it's bullshit right yeah. where bottoms are math yeah it's math and it's also sentiment as well and like we are looking at a lot of data points the data is a lot more accurate at the bottom because less people are trying to to fuck with it because they're all they're fucked already we're yes. in the top there's money there's money in fucking with the the, the numbers i mean glass nodes super famous they fucking like their data was wrong on purpose didn't show that all these fucking long time holding whales were fucking dumping <laughs> <laughs> people are paying for all this data and i was like because uh, I, I saw a bunch of people tweeting out the glass note stuff and i was like something's off by like i was like that's suspicious you know the the, the one that for me when i knew the bull run was over january when the fed said interest they started increasing interest rates yes that's that, that was it fuck and that, i knew and i knew they that, announced I knew that it in november didn't they they announced it uh during uh, around sort, that time. sort of yeah they, they but no one believed it but you know, since GG33 got out in November, um, he wasn't fully he wasn't fully investing into crypto, but he had crypto. He did some good crypto investments, and so does guys. He got out completely in November. He did really well. Um, and not everything topped in November. Obviously, we had stuff topping in January, yeah. and some in December, and stuff like that. But um, basically, I, I, me and Charlie told the guys, hey, this next course right here. Um, we're starting to cash out now, but where there's plays to be made because we, we were making, I was making money on Phantom up yes. until April, early April, and mm -hmm. then it was over. That was over. So I was I was in a couple of yield farming plays. Solidly, Solid Dex came out in early 22. Oh my god, that was some of the biggest money I, I ever made in yield farming ever. Like you're making forty thousand dollars every hour, like sort mm -hmm. of shit like that. Fucking <laughs> Andre, come back, my G, bro. Like <laughs> oh my god, bro. Like. Like, I mean, fuck, dude. I mean, it's, it's, do you know, uh, who, do you know who surprisingly, I'll tell you, <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the pod. That's, that's all you guys did. Yeah. No, uh, what up? <laughs> all these solid decks was the crazy shit because imagine yield farming with no one permanent loss earning 10,000, 8,000 APR. 